we want? Sick pay! When do we want it? Now! What do we want? Sick pay! When do we want it? Now! What do we want? Sick pay! When do we want it? Now! What do we want? Sick pay! When do we want it? Now! This contract's a lucrative contract. Yeah. Ten years, Mears and Mighty have had it. Yeah. And in that time, there's a big group of workers who haven't been getting any sick pay, and we think that's wrong. If you work for the council, then, then you, know, you get sick pay as per the um, local authorities' agreement. If you're working uh, if you work in the office, for example, for, for the contractors, you're getting sick pay. Uh, if you're working out in this weather, doing a job for the same contractor, you're not getting sick pay. And that just encourages people to go into work when they're not well. We got carpenters, multi-traders, electricians, plumbers, roofers, fencers, they're out there in the elements and also in people's houses doing the social housing repairs so it's not very good when they're going really ill like death warmed up that's what my members have been saying they could pass on the germs to the tenants so it's a duty of care that should be for both the tenant and the employee of these contractors they should be at least have the ability to phone in sick and get paid at the moment they have to wait three working days they don't get anything or they get a statutory sick pay Crawley Council have signed up to Unites Construction Charter and this is an attempt by the union to get local authorities on board ensuring decent standards in construction so part of their contracting process they should be making sure that the union has access uh, and, the, and the basic labour standards your know, national agreements and so on are adhered to and the workers have the power to, to enforce those agreements. Having signed the United's Charter we want them to use their influence to push their contractors to play ball. <laughs> Mears and Mighty's contracts are merging next year. The contracts are refusing so far to, to accept the United recognition rolling over and refusing to talk to us about harmonising sick pay. We're not looking for six months full sick pay like the original council workers who cheaply transferred into Mears and Mighty get. We're just looking for sick pay from day one and United's proposal was very modest, one month sick pay. We're going to meet with the members and we're going to work out a strategy for trying to win this issue and it might mean that we have to ballot for industrial action. It's about time that Mears and Mighty gave something back to their people. They've been neglecting them for far too long.